I'm going to give you an update of some of the work that we've been doing to try and measure and increase the impact that Viva and partner networks have on children globally. So um, this year, we have been thinking about how we can easily communicate what we do. And that's by focusing on three child-focused outcomes or changes that we want to see in children's lives. So we looked at the commonalities about how Viva was supporting Viva um, partner networks in each of the regions. And we looked at the programs and activities that they were implementing. And we categorized these into three areas. So we want to see that children are safe, we want to see that children are thriving and we want to see that children are learning. And then we also spent some time thinking about how to more accurate, to accurately <laughs> measure our impact against the three changes we want to see in children's lives. So we have developed indicators um, to measure that those changes are taking place. And you can see them on this slide. Um, at the moment, we're just about to pilot some questions with children that will help us to know what impact Viva's work with our partner networks is having. So then um, thinking about knowing our impact, you might probably all know that each year we run our network health check to monitor, develop and strength, to monitor the development and strength of networks and help networks to identify key areas for improvement. And what happens is a network health check survey gathers information on the systems and the structures and the programs and the reach of partner networks. And then Viva is able to use this information in two ways. Firstly, to support the networks to increase their sustainability. So Viva produces individual tailored reports so that partner networks can know and share their impact. They know which areas to focus on in the coming year. And they also receive individualized support from their Viva network coach or consultant. And then to understand our global work, um, the data is also used to help Viva assess and share our impact um, to identify global development needs and trends so that we can continue to provide quality support for partner networks. So traditionally, completing the NHC has been quite a challenging task for the network coordinators because it asked lots of questions and it required data from them for a whole year to be compiled and categorised at once. So we work this year to find a way to simplify it. And at the end of last year, we launched the new version of the Network Health Check. And the new simpler version of the NHC can now be submitted using a COBO form. You can see an example on the right hand side of the slide. And it should take network coordinators a much shorter time to fill out the form. Um, we also introduced a way of collecting live data to record activities as they happen throughout the year, again, using COBO. So um, we also changed the reporting year from January to December to match the financial year, April to March, to give networks time to get used to the new system. So now all the data has been collated and we've just finished the draft of the global report and we're working on um, completing network reports. And we're also developing an app, which means that in the future, network coordinators will be able to enter the network data onto their phones. So that's about knowing our impact. So increasing our impact, as, as well as knowing our impact on the lives of children, we are looking at how we can increase the impact that networks have. And so one of the ways is to make sure that all the network teams are enrolled on the network training course. Faye talked about that when she was talking about what's happening in the Philippines. Um, and this is a course which Viva has developed about how to develop strong, effective and sustainable networks. Um, and this is now online. We put it online and it's in Spanish and English, which means it's got a wider reach. And also it means that the network teams from different locations can all learn together and, um, as they meet online. We're also developing a series of workshops to deepen the skills of Viva's network coaches so they can be even more effective in their work in supporting and coaching network coordination teams. And we're just about to launch a new network toolkit, which is to equip Viva's coaches with tools and methods for starting new networks. So 
this is the sort of stuff that's going on sort of behind the scenes, but it helps to um, support and develop the networks and then increase the impact that the networks have on children. So it would be great if we could give thanks to God for the work that networks of organizations and churches are doing globally to help children to be safe, to thrive and to learn. And please pray that they will, they will be encouraged as they are able to learn more about the impact of their work. Please pray that the Network Health Check will help networks to know how to become stronger and therefore increase the impact of their work with children. And give thanks to, for, for as well, for Viva's network coaches or, the, or Viva's network consultants. Please pray that the workshops and tools that we're developing will help them to support networks even more effectively. Thank you.